Today guys, I bring you a new world video showcasing all known legendary spears in the game. I will mention a lot of these haven't been obtained yet, so a couple of these we don't actually know where they drop. Also some of the images you will see are placeholder images, so the weapon may look different. But in terms of the weapon's stats and what they offer, it's all here. So let's go. How's it going guys? My name is DPJ and if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out and if you like what you see and want to see more, be sure to subscribe. Okay, so within this video, I will showcase to you all known legendary spears in the game and how they are obtained. Now, like I said, some of the images are placeholder images. And also, I think out of this list here, there's three that haven't been found yet. I'm hoping you guys can help me out with those. So let's get into it. Firstly, we have the Spear of the Outer Isles. So this legendary is obtained from the Blighted Gatekeeper, who is a dungeon boss within the Garden of Genesis Expedition. So you want this Spear of the Outer Isles, this is where you get it from. Next up guys, we have the Sub-Zero Spear. So this legendary drops from three bosses within the Garden of Genesis Expedition. The bosses are Taxodius, Fulda and Farkas. So you want the Sub-Zero Spear, that's where you get it. Next up guys, we have the Angry Earth Exterminator. So this is a legendary that drops from the endgame expeditions of the Lazarus Instrumentality, the Depths and the Garden of Genesis. So if you want a chance of getting this amazing sounding Angry Earth Exterminator, you have to enter into those endgame expeditions. Next up guys, you have the Chaos Spear. So this legendary is a world drop across the board. Obviously, I feel you have to be a certain level before we start seeing these legendaries drop. I think that could be around that level of 40, but don't quote me on that. But it's definitely between 40 and 50. That's when you'll see a lot of these world drop legendaries are starting to appear for you. So yes, the Chaos Spear is a world drop. Next up, guys, we have the Violent Descent. This is a legendary you can craft, obviously using the right materials and levels in engineering are required. So it requires a blacksmith tier of a level 4. You need to be an engineering level of 141. Trade skill XP is around 3750. And territory standing needs to be 100. Next up guys, we have the Soul Forged Spear. This is a legendary you can craft. Again, with the right materials. It requires a station of a blacksmith tier 5. It requires an engineering level of a 200. Trade skill XP needs to be 7,440 and a territory standing of 144. Next up guys, we have the Flawless Grandmaster Spear. This is a legendary you can also craft with the right materials. Trade skill needs to be engineering, requires station of a blacksmith tier 5, requires an engineering level of 186. Trade skill XP needs to be 7,285 and territory standing 141. The next three weapons are unknown at this time, we don't know where they are obtained. They are the Travelling Storm, the Conqueror's Spear and the Spear of the Corrupted Assault. Now there's a few clues of where these could be obtained from but nothing concrete yet. So if you've had any of these drop, please let me know and I'll edit the video, change up the video description so others do know. But there we have it guys, all known legendary spears in the game so far. If you guys enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you're new around here and want to see more new world, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by and hopefully I will see you on that next one.